People come with their friends and family and have picnics. These ones also? All vegetables. Okay, okay, that's fine. Now I'm getting the chili to my eyes. Oh God. Make my video also. You want to be in it? Yes. Oh, nice. I want to be in it. Well, look at this underpass. It's quite cool actually. There it is, up close. How much does he usually charge people? What is the price? Yeah, it's kind of sweet. <laughs> <laughs> this is cooling me down. In Pakistan, I learned Urdu. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, it's good. <laughs> Meranam Philippe. Namaskar. Namaskar. Well, they're doing like uh, tattooing here. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. I don't move like that. No problem. You're just following me. Hey guys, welcome to the video and welcome to the Raj Path. This is the, I guess, center of Delhi, New Delhi. And it is the government area. It's covered with lots of grass on either side of this promenade. And I think the promenade was built in the 1920s, 19, 1930s by the British. And obviously the uh, India was uh, ruled by the British Raj at the time. And this path was, uh, a uh, pass that ran all the way along to what was then known as the Viceroy's house and now it's called Rashtrapati Bhavan hopefully I haven't murdered that pronunciation but um, yeah so this is uh, it all the way down in this direction is India Gate so we're gonna walk there I actually tried to go to Rashtrapati Bhavan and I managed to walk through but there are a lot of police there and um, security people and stuff so they I ended up walking through the kind of government area nearby beside the Ministry of Affairs but but uh, it was not the sort of place that I should bring out a camera but it seems like you can bring out a camera here and take photos and that sort of thing so the Rashtrapati Bhavan is the official residence of the the president obviously the president is Modi right now so so yeah I think you can do guided tours in there that's what they said to me so maybe uh, maybe I'll try and do a, a guided tour in there at some point but for now I just thought we'd take a walk up to to India Gate first and take a look I read online that um, around 35,000 Soldiers from India have been commemorated in India Gate, which I think you guys can see just in the distance there. And they were people who fought in the First World War and the Afghan Wars. And yeah, it's a symbol of national unity and and things. And that, I think that it was erected in the 1930s as well. Um, and obviously the Second World War came along and then uh, Britain left in 1947, but by all accounts, presumably the British believed that they were going to be here, or we were going to be here, I should say, given I'm from uh, Glasgow, but uh, presumably we thought we were going to be here a lot longer, given that we were still building massive mo massive monuments like this uh, right up until the 1930s. But it didn't end up uh, turning out that way. I think obviously the British Empire overextended itself, particularly in the Second World War and militarily that's how most empires collapse and so fortunately for the independent India which actually got its independence in August 15th um, which is just coming up and I tried to go to the Red Fort yesterday but hello <laughs> I tried to go to the Red Fort yesterday but they wouldn't let me uh, go because that's where Modi is going to be doing his president's speech on the 15th of August and so uh, I couldn't go but um, but yeah uh, obviously this uh, this great road with these uh, massive structures obviously the government buildings all the way down there were left when the British left and uh, they formed the basis of the governmental buildings still today here in Delhi 
but there's a big police presence. So yeah, I'm just gonna walk along here and uh, I'll show you guys the India Gate when I get there. But this is the Raj path. Let's try and cross this road. As always in Delhi, you just have to, as a pedestrian, you just walk. Let's just see. Hopefully people just slow down, let you cross. Yeah, you just gotta walk with confidence. There's a police stop here as well. <laughs> yeah, so the Raj path is actually pretty long. It's quite a few kilometers from one end to the one end to the other. And it is a very popular place for people to come and chill with their families and have picnics here on the nice grassy areas. Got this beautiful boulevard with these this lighting. It's actually a very meant to be a very nice place to come in the evenings because a lot of those buildings up at the up at the end are lit up. So the architecture looks amazing and yeah people just come here, chill out, play games and things. And to be honest, it's a very nice uh, reprieve from my uh, experience so far in Delhi. I love the hustle, I love the bustle, but sometimes you just need something calm, tranquil, relaxing, you know, just to stop and breathe for a few minutes and that's what I've been able to do since I've, <laughs> since I've come. I just sat on this grass for a while, just relaxing after being in the, the craziness of the city. But I'll be going back there tonight for uh, some some of the markets, so that'll be good. They also have these. They have this green grass area, but then on either side they have these beautiful trees, which is good because you need some shade. Which I'm going to try try and find for the rest of the walk up towards the India Gate because wow, it can be hot around here. I know I say that in every video, but I'm just not used to used to this weather. But yeah, as you can see, people come with their, hey man, people come with their friends and family and have picnics and that type of thing. Just come chill, read a book. Sit under the trees, on the grass, and it's not too busy, which is nice, which is nice. Hey man. <laughs> what are you eating? Popcorn. Nice. There's also this lake, although it doesn't, or canal that runs along, but for some reason this part of it hasn't been uh, hasn't been filled up with water. But I saw the main part up there did have some water in it, so presumably they only fill some of it up with water. And then they save the rest for special occasions, I guess. Who knows? It's a little map of the Kartavia path. Is that what it's called instead of Raj path? Oh yeah, Kartavia Path, so that must be the new name. And then this is India Gate that we're walking towards. But that is the originally Viceroy's Palace or Residence, and now it's the Rashtravadi Bhavan. And then like I said, they've got these canals that run alongside. And then there's government buildings on either side, so yeah. This is the... What do they call it now? This is... Kartavia... Kartavia Pass. This is the Kartavia Pass, not the Raj Pass. That's a big thing that I've seen in some of the countries that I've been traveling to when I was in uh, Africa. A lot of the a lot of the countries wanted to rename some of the some of the things from the from the past. Like uh, I think Victoria Falls. A lot of the people in Zambia and Zimbabwe wanted to re rename that another name which has completely escaped me but yeah because obviously they've been named after aspects of the the British Empire and since these countries got their independence they want to uh, rename some of these structures to no longer be associated with that that history which I guess makes sense things can change names over time Guys carrying some uh, some grass bags of grass. Obviously, they've been doing some uh, maintenance on the on the grass here, and 
yeah you can tell this area is very very well kept which is awesome I can't say the rest of uh, Delhi is in quite as good shape as this it's quite uh, quite dirty but um, that's just the way that it is like the people super friendly the food very tasty but just like the stuff all over the streets and that it would be given the fact that India is oh let me check if I've got enough battery hey man uh, given the fact that India is so developing so fast you would hope that some of the some of the spend on infrastructure could uh, could also begin to improve some of these areas that that just need continual maintenance it's hard I know but uh, you know that's definitely something that you would expect from a country that's uh, that's growing as fast as India but there's priorities everyone's got to decide what they're going to spend money on so governments need to decide but it is what it is starting to get a bit busier along this end and I'm hearing uh, music being played so maybe maybe it gets busier at India Gate I'm gonna get some water though hello how are you? hey man you have cold water? Okay. how much? 50 50? Yeah. thank you Opa, oops. <laughs> Thank you. God, I've got it all over me. Thank you. Hello, how are you? What are these? Oh, huh? rupees. What is it? What? Rupees. Yeah, what? Uh, One plate. It's is it meat? Yes. Okay, I will have this one. One piece, how much? 50 rupees. 50 rupees for one piece? 6 pieces. 3 pieces, 50 rupees. Okay, 3 pieces, 60 rupees. Okay. Uh, wait. There you go. Uh, but are these meat? No, I'm asking, is it vegetarian? Yeah, yeah. These ones also? All vegetables. All vegetables. Okay, okay. That's fine. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so hot. I don't know what's inside these things. What is inside these? This is a Ram Nadu. Ram Nadu? Yeah. But what is the English name? You know? The English name Ram, Ram Puleto Sri Ram. God, God. Okay. Yeah. God food. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Good food, God food. Okay, and this is chili. This is chili. Chili, okay. And I get salad as well? Shalak, shalak, shalak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. What is going on today? There's some music. Music is uh, 15. Uh, oh, because of Independence Day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're already partying. Uh, this is a music check. Music check. Sound check. Got it. Yeah. So is there a party happening on the 15th? No party and only lecture. Uh, Prime Minister is lecture. Yeah, yeah. But I thought uh, Red Fort. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, the uh, Indigo band said uh, more museum. He will do it there as yeah. well. Okay, nice. Thank you so much. Wow, this looks amazing. I'm gonna go and eat it there. Thank you. Right, let's cross the road. <laughs> gonna try and find somewhere to go and sit down and eat my. Uh, I don't know what this sauce is on this but it looks it's good hopefully it's not hopefully it's spicy i quite like the spicy spicy food yeah it's starting to get a bit busier over in this over in this area mm. all these little squirrels are so cute i was actually seeing some monkeys as well earlier uh on at the rashtrava bavan i'm not sure how to pronounce that Anyways, maybe I'll just sit down here. It looks like there's some shade. Hello, how are you? Hey man, do you know what this is? Oh. Thanks. Thank you. Let's have a little bit of this. Try it over 
over there because I'm gonna get done for copyright if I stay here. There's India Gate anyway. As I walk over there. Oh, I've actually I've got I've got some uh, I've got some sweat going in my eyes. This music in the background is causing me a problem actually. So I'm gonna just stop the video until the music stops. But yeah, there is India Gate. It's very impressive. We'll go and have a look at India Gate and see some of the names being commemorated there for people who died in the wars. Yeah, so there's people selling stuff around this area. And then you can see they've actually... No thank you, no thank you, no thank you. No, thank you. you can actually see the, the canal is now full at this part. So they must just cut it off halfway down the... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just call it the Raj path. But they must just... Oh. They must, they must just turn the, turn the water off, halfway down the Raj path, and then, and then start it back when they uh, get close to India Gate. Right, we're far enough away from the water that I can try some of this delicious, delicious food. So there you go. There's a, so it's kind of like a doughy type consistency. God food. Because I think it's called something to do with ram. And then, oh, I better not make sure my phone doesn't go in the water. There's a magpie trying to trying to steal my food. If you guys can see that bridge in the background, it looks cool. So these chilies look awesome. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, it's like chilies with batter. Amazing. That is so good. And then we're gonna get some of this uh, sauce on there. Ooh, amazing. Yum. But also it's so hot. Oh my God. And now I'm getting the chili to my eyes. Oh God, disaster. Okay guys, I'm gonna turn off the video and then I'm gonna start it once I've sorted myself out. Oh. Oh my god, if anyone wanted an answer as to whether that sauce is chilli is hot. Wow, spicy sauce. I was just sitting in the heat. Ate a chilli. Now I'm sweating. I think I was doing okay before this. Mm. Right, let's go and have a look at Delhi, Delhi Gate. Scotland. Scotland. I'm making a YouTube video. Oh make my video also. You want to be in it? Yes. Oh nice. I want to be in it. What's your name? Oh, you know Hindi. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Ritik. Ritik? Yes. My name is Philip. I'm sweating because it's so hot. Yes, there is so much sunshine. That and time. also I ate some of these chili, something chili from uh, the yeah. food stall. I, I saw you that time you are sitting at behind the Yeah, I sat, I sat near, down. Yeah. Yes, and you are eating the pakoras. Pakora, yeah. yeah. That it's is called pakora. Is that pakora? pakora. But it's, it's, they called it. They said it was ram something to do. With ram ladu. Ram ladu. Yes. Oh. We call that ram ladu in normal language. It's called pakora. Oh, okay, I tried pakora before, but oh. I hadn't tried that pakora because usually it has do you vegetables. Like them? Do you like them? That bit, that one didn't have vegetables inside. It was just yes, like this a. This is uh, reddish. 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 Oh, really? Yes. Hello. How are you? Hello. Good. <laughs> do you read reddish? They are cut in the small small part ah. and uh, they got chutney over it oh really yeah yeah the green the stuff. green stuff that's yeah. hot this is a chili and also i got a ch I, I got the chili uh the chili that was co coated as well yes oh, i'm sweating because of the the hotness as well are and you just chilling with your family yeah. no no oh. i'm here photographer oh really i click photos for part-time job nice nice good man good man I'm doing how's, graduation. How's business? how's business going? I'm doing graduation. Okay. What are you studying? Yes. Humanities. Humanities? Yes. Oh, nice. At the Delhi University? Yes, from Delhi University. Nice, man. Well, and what do you do? I just make YouTube videos and that's it. Only that. How much subscribers do you have? Just 50,000. Oh, oh my God, 50,000? Yeah. 
You are growing. I'm growing. Yes. But inshallah. Yes. Why am I saying inshallah? I'm sa I used to say uh, inshallah all the time because I travelled around Pakistan. Oh. Uh, and now I came to India. What do you say? What do you say when you want to say God willing? Uh, Bhagwan kare. Bhagwan. Aka YouTube channel or bade. Or bade. Bhagwan kare. God is Bhagwan. Bhagwan kare. Kare. Aka YouTube channel. Okay. Or bade. Grow kare. Grow kare. Or ah. okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Well, What's, I'm just going to continue down to India. What again. is the channel name? I'll tell you. Yeah. I will subscribe for you. Nice man. How often do you come and take people's pictures around here? They want to you, clean some photos? No, I'm okay. I'm okay. But thank you. But do you do it a lot? How many hours no, a week? No. Hello, my friend. How are you? I'm fine. Good. This picture? No, I'm okay. But thank you. What is your name? My name? Yeah. Suraj. Suraj. Suraj man, son. Ah. The meaning of the Suraj is sun. Oh, Suraj, sun. Yes, okay. Yes. Good in, to know. Well, Suraj in is... Hindi, in Hindi, we call sun Suraj. Okay. okay. Suraj, is the Suraj is making me very hot. Why is this hot? <laughs> hot man. You will take me in video? You'll be in the video. How, how many days after? Maybe four days. Okay. I will see. <laughs> okay. Okay. Go, man. Okay. See you later. Okay. All right. Suraj. No, I'm okay, I'm okay. But okay, uh, how much money do you make from making pictures? Okay, okay, okay. But how much is one picture? Only 100. 100 for a picture? One piece. And how many pictures do you do a day? The tries are no try money. Oh, okay. One piece. These are nice. Like, like, come this way. Go no, no, me. no, I'm okay, but thank the you. The cell transfer? I'm okay, I will sell photography. Okay. Thank you. Though. Okay. Okay. No, thank you. Everyone is offering everything, everywhere. It's good though, people are doing business. This road looks a little bit more intimidating to cross. We will do it though. Opa. Thank you. Okay. There we are. There's some more food places around here. I wonder if there's any juice. What are these? Hey man. Uh, what, 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 what is it? What is it? El Puri. Okay, I'll try it. One plate. Uh, I will. I will come back. I will come back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I stood on your foot. Not right now. Let me. Let me go see there and then I come back. Okay. Thank you. See you. Huh? Underpass. Underground. Oh, I can't go through, no? No, no, no. Oh. So where do I go? You have to get take the underpass to get across there. Interesting. So now I have to cross the road again. We take the underpass underneath. Look, this guy's selling some sunglasses. Hello. No, I'm okay. Oh. So that. Look at this underpass, it's quite cool actually. Down there. Guys, I don't know how... Oh, there's a bin. I don't know how you guys manage. In this heat, I just see everybody... What's up guys? You good? I just see people walking around. Not even a bead of sweat on them. And I'm a mess. <laughs> so this has got bunch of uh, information around the building of this so what oh 1931 the new capital was inaugurated this is from 1935 so 1935 would they have had the the Delhi gate I'm not sure but that's the that's the um, that's the president's residence there and then the, we walked basically from there all the way interesting that's good they've got all the photos from the past and then they've got images of the lakes and things that's the Delhi the India gate oh and they've done a big refurbishment so actually it wasn't as well developed 
as this. They've done some uh, some more work to improve it. Complete circuit of walkways. That's cool. Ah, so this has actually been developing over the years. It wasn't just just developed all uh, during the time of the British Empire. It's been developed, further developed over time, which is why it looks so new and well uh, well maintained. They're obviously con constantly improving this area. Like this work that's happening here, actually. Obviously, they're doing some construction work here to to improve these paths. But why can't they do more work like this around the rest of the city? There it is, up close. That's Delhi Gate. Nope, it's not Delhi Gate, it's India, India Gate. And this is, this commemorates the uh, dead Indian armies, the the dead of the Indian armies who fell and are honoured in France and Flanders. Mesopotamia, Persia, East Africa, Gallipoli and elsewhere. In the near and far east and in sacred memory of those whose names are here recorded and who fell in India on the north west frontier and during the third Afghan war. No thank you. Which country sir? Scotland, thank you. No thank you. Yeah, so there it is. Wow, it's actually very, very impressive. Up, uh, up close. I want to see where all the names are though. And I also heard that there was a fire that was burning constantly. Um, that was to commemorate all of the unnamed soldiers who they, uh, yeah, like they don't have the names of the of the soldiers, but they they have this fire to commemorate those people. Also. Um, so yeah, looks like there's uh, some control as to who can enter, so you can't actually get close up to the to see the names. Hello. <laughs> but there's names all all inside the the walls here, and people come to get pictures beside India Gate. And there in the distance, you can see the government buildings and all the names are in the inside on that side as well very very impressive I'm not sure about uh, the fire though I can't see the fire there oh sweating a lot all right guys I'm gonna go and get some food. How much is five dollars in Indian money? I don't know. Give it your dollar country is the dollar, five dollars in Indian money. Yeah, but I'm not from the US, I'm from the UK. Give your country all people is dollar is okay. But I can tell you how much it is. Yeah. But I'm yeah. not going to give you Indian money for it. But uh you want me to tell you how much it is? Five dollars. Uh five dollar is USD to Indian rupee. I have the not allowed it the bank, sir. I have the big problem. It is 414 Indian rupees. No, I'm sorry, but that is how much it is. Give me 400, no problem. I'm sir. okay, but sorry. Thank you. I'm staying in India for a long time, and I'm not from the US. Nice try, though. I'm not even sure if it was a real, is that a real US dollar? Who knows? You hear about so many so many tricksters here in in uh, in Delhi like uh, scams going on so I don't want to get scammed for five dollars hello sir hello hello I will have well how much how much one hundred rupees not a hundred rupees yeah. what are you talking about hundred oh. rupees 50 rupees. 50 rupees. 20 rupees. 50 rupees. For what? What are you giving me? Spicy or what? How much does he usually charge people? What is the price? 20. What? I feel like I'm getting the foreigner price. Spicy. Wait, what do I have? I only have 30. I have 30. That's all I have in my pocket. Is that okay? 
What else is here? Okay. There you go, bro. Thank you. Alright, let's try this. I don't know what this is though. It looks like uh, just the sort of cereal that I would have for breakfast, but I would have it sweet in the UK. So it seems strange. No thank you. Yeah, it's kind of sweet. And then he's put some nuts in it. And like, these are green peas. So it's kind of sweet and savory. It looks like it's got cornflakes in it as well. I'm not gonna lie guys. The sauce is quite tasty. But I don't think it's my favorite sweet. All right, so this is India, India Gate, the Raj Path. You want the rest of this? No, I'm gonna finish. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> Cheeky wee guy. I like it. I like the energy. I like the energy, India. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. It is a bit annoying when people don't listen to you when you say no. But when people are cheeky and give you that energy, like, then that's funny. But it's annoying when people like follow you down the street and stuff like that, which I've already had and I've only been here about four or five days, so. Yeah. I don't know what to say. I like the hustle, but just take it easy. Take it easy, guys. Like, if somebody says no, you're gonna, do you know what the thing is? If everybody in India was to just chill out with the hard sell, then so many more people would come here, but because everyone here is like, or has this feeling, and then they'll go home and tell their friends, and then they'll say like, hey, yeah, India was good, but people kept on trying to sell me stuff the whole time, and it was annoying. So, you're gonna get more people coming to visit if everyone just collectively chills out on the hard sell front. I'm not saying don't approach people, but if they say no, then take no for an answer. I think I will have an ice cream, yeah. How much? Oh. One and ten. Fifty rupees, fifty rupees. I think I will just have one of... Uh, no. Magnum? No. I think I will just have... Uh, the mango? I think the mango, yeah. This one? Uh, no, lemon. No lemon. No lemon. Orange. What? No lemon. Orange. Okay, I take orange. One? Yeah, one. So, there's Two. 20. One. Five rupee change? Huh? No changes, fine. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Shukriya. shukriya. <laughs> Okay, a little ice cream. That was 15, 15 rupees. That was, uh, that's very cheap. Considering that little bowl of cereal. Well, that cost me 30. This is cooling me down. They have this cool little market over here as well. Let's take a look around. I've got a couple more hundred in my pocket. I just found when I was searching for that ice cream. But yeah, what do they sell here? More of the cereal stuff with the peas and things. I find that stuff quite strange. Ah, is this a uh, pani puri or something? I might come back to it. This one I've not tried. Hey man, how are you? How are you? Indian Pan. Indian Pan. Indian Pan. Pawaji. Pawaji. Yeah. 
आपका नाम क्या है सेवेंटी रुपीज मेरा नाम फिलिप है आपका नाम क्या है अनिता हाँ नाइस टू मीट यू एंड यू आपका नाम चालू चालू दैट्स को इज दैट एक्चुअली हिज नेम चालू या एंड दिस इज टेस्टी जी ओके आई वो ट्राई ट्रम हाई मच कितना पैसा है वन प्लेट सेवेंटी रुपीज ओके थैंक यू मी शुक्रिया बहुत शुक्रिया Actually, I learned in uh, in Pakistan. I learned Urdu. Yeah. Yeah. And and you speak similar Hindi and Urdu, very similar, yeah. Huh? Hindi speak really little little, yeah. Yeah. So we fry the bread, yeah? Right. I tried it already. It's very it's it's very tasty. How do you say tasty? Tasty. This you like me tasty. You eat tasty. Huh? You eat tasty. You taste. No, but how do you say this is delicious? Yeah, but how do in Hindi? Hindi. Yeah, delish. The word delicious. Yeah. How do I say delicious in Hindi? Little, little. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. All right. I will have. I will buy some water from you as well. Water. Yeah. Pani. Pani. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you want pani? Yeah. Cold. Cold. Chill water. Huh? Chill. Chill water. Yeah. Oh, nice. Wait one second. You have uh, how much is this? Yeah, twenty-five. Twenty-five. He has my change. Okay. okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. See you later. <laughs> Hi. Oh, and then they've got fruit there as well. But where do I, where do I eat? Maybe I'll go and sit on this wall. Hey man, I'm going to be stuffed. Oh, I've already. <laughs> the camera angle is a bit strange, I know. So let's try this. I don't know what this is. Is this some sort of dal? What they put there? I got told my Hindi is good. I need to learn some more words. But it's starting to come back. All right, so we've got this kind of dal looking thing here. And then we put dip the bread in it, I guess. Ooh, it's good. Oh my god. I wish I'd got my ice cream after this though. Man, that's tasty. <laughs> the guy's waving at me because I'm filming myself. So, what do I think of this? I think this is probably my favorite food that I've had today. Although those chilies were very good earlier. The pakora wasn't so good earlier. I didn't like, he said, somebody told me that they were filled with radish. The ram ones, but yeah, I wasn't really a big fan of those. They tasted like cakes more than anything. But the chili ones covered with the batter, they were good. But it's too hot for chili, and the sauce was very hot. I didn't really like that cereal stuff, to be honest. Although the sauce that they put it in was was good, but it was kind of too sweet, and it just tasted like I was having breakfast. This stuff is very delicious. It's like a dal, but with peas inside. Hello. <laughs> and then obviously the ice cream is very delicious as well. And that lady that served me the water. Oh my god, I need some water as well. <sighs> Guys, this is like my what's this? My fourth video in India. I'm uh, I'm beginning to acclimate quite well to this uh, this country. I think it's uh, I think I'm going to enjoy myself. I haven't decided exactly when I'm going to leave to go up to Amritsar, but so far I'm enjoying exploring Delhi, going around CP, Rajpath, or whatever they call it these days. Um, 
Where else have I been? Pahar Ganj. Tried to get into Red Fort. So yeah, you can check out some of my other videos about those places, but so far, I'm having a good time here. And we will continue our journey in another video. But for now, I'm going to, I uh, think I'm gonna, hey man, how are you doing? How are... Huh? Sorry? Where have you gone? <laughs> Are you hiding? <laughs> See you later. <laughs> How are you guys? Good. What is this called? The white thing? Ah, oh, you're coming round. Oh, come round. Yes. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Rakesh. I'm Rakesh. Nice Good. to meet you. And you? Philip. Philip. Yeah. Nice to meet you. From where are you? Scotland. Scotland. I'm with the guys. <laughs> I want to know where do you get this? And what is it called? Huh? The name? What is the name? Panish. Panish. Uh -huh. Your your name's Panish. Uh -huh. But this thing is called Do you speak English? No, no okay. I'm <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> well nice to meet you all. Mm -hmm. Mera naam Philippe. Thank you. Namaskar. 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 <laughs> I'm trying the tasty food. It's very good. Scotland. Scotland, yeah. Scotland. Yeah, I'm from Scotland. My name is Philip. I have a YouTube channel. I make videos in India. Nice. I want to selfie with you. Okay, we can do a selfie. Okay. Does your friend have? Uh, oh, you want to do it on your camera, or we do it together like this? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> good. We're on it. Okay, you want to do it on your camera? Alright. Nice. Thank you. No worries, no worries. <laughs> we're, doing a, we're doing a photo session now. <laughs> I want to get one of these, they look delicious. Ice cream. Yeah, yeah. They sell them over here, yeah? What's your name? Naveen. Naveen? Nice to meet you. <laughs> Alright, we'll do a selfie as well. Alright, let's do it. I'm sweating, so watch out for your hand behind my back. No worries. Oh, we do this. Nice. Okay, I'll dig it. <laughs> oh, you want one too? Okay. Okay, Alright. Thank <laughs> you. See you guys later. Have a nice day. I'm gonna finish this uh, this meal. Yum. Nice guys around here. I think it's like if the, as long as people aren't trying to. Oh. You want a selfie too? Smile, eh? You want me to smile? Okay, I will try. But you have to smile also. You didn't. <laughs> you can't make me smile if you don't smile. <laughs> oh, you did smile. You did smile. It's okay. <laughs> All right. Nice one. See you guys later. Yeah, like I was saying, I think if people aren't selling you something, then everyone's super friendly and welcoming and all of that stuff. But if people are like trying to sell too much, then it's, it becomes a bit hectic, to be honest. More than some of the other places I've been in my life. Hey, man. <laughs> yeah. So this is the pool, and oh, man, it's like it's getting a lot cooler now. That's great. Wow, they're doing like uh, tattooing here. <laughs> you do what tattoos? Tattoo, tattoo. Hundred rupee one inch, color my one fifty one. hundred, and these are permanent. Permanent. Permanent tattoos for a hundred rupees. What? Look at this. Can I film? Here you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, tw
I uh no eh no I'm okay. Thank you. No thank you, no. No thank you. Ah no thank you. No thank you. No no I'm okay. It's just permanent. Not for me, but thank you. Okay, but no, please take it off. One hand you can see. Please you can take it off. Please take it off. <laughs> I don't want one. Thank you. I don't want so yeah yeah please take it off. Yeah. Okay, but please take it off. Thank you so much. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. I'm trying to be polite. Hello? No, I don't. I know. I don't want one. Baby daughter, children like. What? Baby daughter like children like. I don't. Yeah, but I don't. I don't. Your family like gift you. Yeah, but I don't want them. Honey, do please. Yeah, but I don't want them. So, thank you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I think I'll get an orange juice though. What are you selling? Pan. Oh. Pan, pan, pan. And one piece. And one piece. No, thank you. Um. No, I don't. I don't want. I don't want. So, thanks. Sorry. Uh, do you know what? I don't think I have enough cash actually. Uh, I don't. I only have. Uh, what do I have? <laughs> are you gonna give me one for ten? Uh, let me see what I have. I take one for. How much are these? Fifty. Huh? Fifty. Fifty. One okay. piece. But wait, what? Very tasty, sir. Very tasty. Okay, I will take one. She's putting on all this extra stuff. What is this called? Very tasty. What is it called? Pan, but uh... Pan. Fire pan? Fire, fire pan. Fire pan? Fire pan? Fire pan. Can you do fire? Ah, uh, fire. Fire <laughs> pan. Picture? Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, you, no you can take it. But I will just uh, film him uh, making it. I will give it to you in one second. One second, thank you. <laughs> I want to uh, film the fire. Ooh. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. And then what do we do? I put this in my hand. Yeah, tissue paper. Tissue paper. And then? So you then you hold? Ah, yeah, but. do I eat it while it's burning? No, but uh, record me. Here, can you see? Okay, am I in it? Ah, uh, I don't know. No, wait. Um, no problem, is no it problem. dangerous? No problem. No problem. Can I go out? No. I don't move by that one. No problem. No problem. Nothing, nothing. Significant porch. Yes, clean. Yes, clean. Oh, 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 Hand it, hand it, hand it. Well, My first fire pan experience. It's good. I was a bit scared. I was scared. I thought it was going to burn me, but it didn't. Okay, so, but I think I only have 50. I think I only have 50. Hand it, hand it. Yeah, but I only have 50. I only... I only have... I only have 60. I only have 60. Oh, I can... No, no. I'm sorry. But thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. I will come back another day and I will give you the rest, I promise. My face, yeah. I need to go to the bank machine. Thank you so much. Alright, see you guys later. <laughs> no, thank you. I, yeah, yeah, I, I'm okay. No, thank you. 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 Sorry, dude. I'm okay. Thank you. Wow, it's hectic around here. Oh, man. I'm, that's such a shame. I only had 60. I thought it was 50 for the fire, uh, 150 for the fire pan as well. I've run out of money. Oh well.
Yeah. Hey, you. What are you doing? Over there. You just following me. Hiya. All right. Hiya. Well, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what's going on with this kid. Ah. <laughs> right, guys. I I'm gonna. Oh. Well, I shouldn't have turned around. No. Nah. <laughs> Sorry, bro. I'm gonna just have to like run away. Oh god. <laughs> Stay there. <laughs> How are you? I'm KC here. Yeah? What's your name? Jinko. Jinko? Ah. My name Philip. Nice to meet you. Are you enjoying? What is this? What is the name? Katoli. Katoli. Ah, oh, okay. Thank you. Alright guys, I'm going to end the video here. That's been a fun adventure. Met some cool people. Tried some tasty food. Seen some cool things. What's not to like? So, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.